So we're going to be linking one consonant to another consonant. This happens when one word ends in a consonant and the next begins with a consonant. You will smoothly link those two together. And here are some examples. Bedtime, cell phone, gas mileage, and ice cream. Now we're talking about consonant sounds, not consonant letters. For example, the PH in phone is actually an F sound. It's written with a P and an H in letters, but the sound is an F. And this is even more noticeable with ice cream. The CE ending is an S sound. But notice what I said. The E is actually a vowel letter. It's a written vowel letter. But the sound that is represented by the CE is an S sound. And that's what we're looking for. We're actually looking for consonant sounds, not letters. Now let's take a look at a specific example when the consonant of one word is the same as the consonant that begins the next word. When that is the case, we are only going to pronounce the consonant one time. You will see it written twice, but only pronounce it once. Examples being gas station, phone number, and part time. Make sure you don't insert any additional syllables or sounds between that. It's not gas a station or phone a number, it's gas station, phone number, part time. Make sure it sounds smooth and connects nicely together. All right, have a good day. All right, now let's do a little bit of practice connecting our words together when one word ends with the same consonant the next one begins with. What time is it? Just repeat after me and take note the double consonants are written in red. What time is it? It's 719. Oh no, it's so late. I've got to go. Do you have Victor's backpack? Yeah, here it is. Great, thanks. See you later. I have to drop Patrick off at school. Many consonants easily blend together. It may seem awkward at first to combine sounds you ordinarily don't see together, but you'll quickly get the hang of it. And there are a few little tricks. Notice that many N consonants will soften or even shift a bit in your mouth so that they can blend more easily into the beginning consonant that follows. You may find the final consonant may not even fully be pronounced. Be careful you don't add an extra syllable or an extra sound between these consonants.